Hi, welcome to your channel, The Ancients. I'm your host, Dr. Ghosh, and I'm back today with another very transformational and informative video for all of you. Friends, the video I bought for you today on your favorite channel, The Ancients, is about the different type of wicks you can use for lighting your diyas in your puja room and the benefits of using these different type of wicks. I am sure your life will be transformed after sharing this information with you. But before that, I would like to share with you a brief about the channel, The Ancients. Friends, today on this channel, we have got over 690 subscribers, 20,000 views and we have uploaded over 240 videos. I wish to express my heartfelt gratitude to all my subscribers. And for all those of you who have not yet subscribed, please do subscribe to the channel now by pressing the subscribe button. Please also press the bell icon so that you get an update on every new video which I bring for you. And also like the videos and share them with your friends and family. Encourage them to join our family when their lives are benefited and their lives are transformed. You'll be welcoming good karmas into your life and your life will also be transformed. Please do subscribe to the channel. Now coming back to the topic of the day. In my previous video, which I released on the channel, which was on the different type of oils and the benefits along with the right direction of lighting the lamps in your puja room, I had committed to you that in this video I will be sharing with you details about different types of wicks you can use and their benefits for lighting lamp of the puja rooms. Now the most common wick which most people use are cotton wicks. What does this help in? Good fortune? Stabilizes your fortune? Nothing more than that. It's a common wick and just stabilizes your fortune. Next, red cotton cloth wick. If you li light the dia in your puja room with a red cotton cloth, it removes all children related obstacles in your life and removes also marriage related obstacles in your life. This is extremely beneficial. Second, it's very important that when you are using red cotton cloth, you light the dia in the eastern direction of your home. Third type of wick which you can use is the cotton stem wick. This is made out of the fi fiber of the cotton stem. Lotus stem. I apologize. The third kind of wick you can use is the lotus stem wick which is made out of fiber of lotus stem. Now, what are the benefits of using the lotus stem wick? The benefits is it will resolve all your unresolved karmas of the previous births. It will bring prosperity into your life, reduce your debts. It brings blessings of Ma Saraswati in addition to Ma Lakshmi. So it enhances your wisdom and knowledge and it gives you a happy and successful life. The lotus stem wick when used properly, gives you tremendous blessings. Number four, if you want to please Ma Durga, then use a yellow cloth as a wick and pray to Ma Durga. You will be blessed by Ma Durga, especially during Navrats. To obtain the blessings of Ma Durga for any of your wishes, please use the yellow cloth wick. Fifth, if yellow sari cloth is used, for lighting the diya as a wick in your puja room then it will solve all martial problems and all difficulties in your love relationships will disappear number seven rose water wick this can be made very simply by dipping a white cloth inside rose water and then lighting the dia using this as a wick. The blessings are prosperity and peace of mind. 
the rose water wick is very simple to make and gives lot of prosperity and peace of mind. 7. You can use the banana wick. Now, if you use the banana wick for lighting the diyas as a wick in your puja room, diya, you will be blessed with forgiveness for mistakes committed by you unknowingly. Pitra dosha will get resolved and you will also get the blessings of your ancestors. So if you are having Pitra dosha, you have suffering from curse of your ancestors, you are having difficulties as related to getting the blessings of your ancestors, then use the banana wick. The tenth and the most important wick which I would like to share with you is the white madar wick. Now, the white madar wick when used in your puja room for lighting the diyas in your puja room gives you blessings of good health, blessings of Lord Ganpati. It gives you victory over your enemies, ensures that court cases are settled in your favor, gives you success in competitive exams, very beneficial for students, enhances your savings and gives you prosperity, gives you peace of mind. If someone is not returning the money owed to you from their side, you can write, use this wick, white madar wick, and you will be blessed with the return of your owed money. Malefic powers, Jadu Tona, Evil Eye, Nazar Dosh, all of this is removed by using the White Madar Wick. Especially any Jadu Tona done on the home will be removed if you use this wick. And I recommend to you that you use this wick. Pick it up. It's available in general stores today and use this wick. This is very beneficial. I would also have two, three additional advice for you. Never use more than two or three wicks in lighting the diya. And again, I repeat, when you're lighting the diya, do not clean your oily fingers on your hair or on your clothes. Keep a separate cloth for that. Doing so will bring poverty for you for you and your family members. Friends, I am sure your life will be transformed with this information which I have shared with you. Try it and share with me the results. I would like to once again request all those of you who have not yet subscribed to please subscribe to the channel. Press the bell icon so that you get an update on every new video which I release for you and also share these videos with your friends and family. Encourage them to become a part of our family so that they experience the transformational benefits of being a subscriber to this channel. I will be back very soon. Before I leave, I would like to express my heartfelt gratitude to all my subscribers. Thank you for all of you. Good luck. All the best. I will return very soon with another very transformational video, informative video. This is Dr. Ghosh signing off. Thank you.